Hi people, today is Thursday, we are, there's supposed to be a great motorcycle ride tonight on Thursday, every Thursday night here in Hawaii, in Honolulu, there's a group, there's a chapter 291 motorcycle ride, um, chapter 91 is a rebel, kind of rebel motorcycle group that, um, they call themselves chapter 291 because of the or the they, they named themselves chapter 291 after the Honolulu revised statues chapter 291 which is pretty much um, the rule on the law on um, excessive modifications and um, basically illegal mods and things like loud mufflers and setups like that so that's what they call themselves chapter 291 and you know I haven't gone on their Thursday rides surprisingly because there's always something that is that has come up and <clears throat> so anyway that's that's something for tonight however it looks like boy it sure looks cloudy but then again, Hawaii, with Hawaii, you never know what the weather is going to be like because, you know, if it rains, it's going to rain for like, I don't know, usually for 30 minutes, maybe 15, and then there, there it is. There's no more rain. So, who knows what it's going to be like. And then, um, okay, well, okay, okay, okay. Here's, I'll, I'll tell you, I know what I'll tell you guys about. Yesterday I went on a blind date. <laughs> I know all you guys are all you guys are voyeurs, man. You all all you guys want to know about. Well, you're in Hawaii and there's all these beautiful women and where are they? How come I don't see them? So, okay, okay, okay. You know, maybe it's not on video yet. I don't know, I don't know whatever. It's not on video, but um Anyway, I'll tell you guys about the date. It's really interesting. Um, it turns out that this gal's younger than me, and she's she's owned a couple sports cars, a couple NSX sports cars, and she just bought herself a Porsche SUV. I think it's the Cayman. Kaim I don't know what the hell that is. Uh, okay, we get my favorite poison first, <laughs> and then uh, lady's gonna ask me for my helmet. <laughs> oh, look at this kid. <laughs> Dollar fifty for a two liter. I got my shades down. I don't know if you guys saw my shoe birth video, but my shades are down, so you can't even see my eyes. Thank you. Okay, so put away the cash. Alrighty then. Okay, so um so so I see this gal, she's uh she's a Korean gal, younger than me, used to be a speed skate champion now I guess she's had a she's had quite a profile so for those that live in Hawaii <laughs> um, and she's very proud of the fact that she she was a speed skate champion which is okay I mean you, yeah if, if shoot if you were in like the Olympics and stuff and that's her claim to fame and it's a it's a tremendous life accomplishment yeah sure I'd be talking about it all the time you know so she made sure I knew that she was a speed skate speed skate champion several times over 
which is fine you know I acknowledge her those years of hard work and I, do, I acknowledge that accomplishment which is very yeah, but but I, it's not it seems like it is her identity and um, she wants recognition which and that's good that's good that's really good um, so anyway uh, we got on the topic of skating and I asked her about rollerblading because when when I saw speed skating I thought you know that's something I that I'd want to do once at least once in my life I'd like to at least try and and it, it had once been a dream of mine it had once been a dream of mine to to try and speed skate or, or to at least do the skating thing but the dream had died when I busted my skull on my bicycle about a decade ago my um, my entire left side is titanium um, I have titanium plates in my face so anyway motorcycling died for me I, I didn't want I, I, I wasn't gonna get on a bicycle again and so the dream of motorcycling died for me and here I am I'm motorcycling so the dream came back alive this year um, it got resurrected and I think I think that's um that's a great thing and speed skating was kind of like in my brain too something that I wanted to try anyhow the deal is um, yeah she inspired me to I mean she it, she didn't do anything I pretty much inspired myself after I heard her and I went online and I asked her what the best skates were and I talked about rollerblades and she said Bont, B-O-N-T was the skate to have okay so so um yeah so I looked it up and I do my did my research and that's the kind of personality I am if I get into something I'll really go for it just like this video thing this video logging you know some of me some of you folks may have been inundated with like freaking five to eight videos in one day in one crack and yeah that's that's what I do I do what I do I just if I find something I love I'll go all out but when I get bored with it it just turns off and I think um, that should be my video log for today if you guys want to know more about the blind date add some commentary and uh, and I'll tell you about it <laughs>